everyone my name is Rupin Nepal Singh and this is tutorial video for how to do multi sun analysis in 3ds max all right so yeah so if you want to do multi sun analysis in 3ds max you actually have to select what type of software that you want to use to render your analysis so in this video i'm going to show you how you can use vray for your multi sun analysis all right so first of all you need to have your uh, model ready for which you want to do your multi sun analysis and then what i'm going to do is show you how you can create a light source and for the light source i'm gonna use daylight which you can go uh, create by going into creation panel then systems and then click on daylight and after that anywhere on your screen click and drag for your compass and when you release the click it will go to the height parameters of your light source it uh, it actually doesn't matter right now what height you set for your light source because what daylight does it's uh, that is it gives you option to actually select the exact location of your project so I'm gonna do Australia Melbourne for your example and after that you can also change to what hours you want to uh, render your model in and you can select your months days even the years or also seconds all right so now what happened is this daylight is not a v-ray light source right now and to convert this daylight into v-ray uh, what we have to do is go to modify then in daylight parameters under the sunlight click on this list and select v-ray sun it will show you a floating window if you like to convert your environment to v-ray sky click yes because that's what we want yes and yeah so from from now what we have to do is uh, yeah create multiple sun so for that what we can do is either follow all the steps to creating a daylight then converting into v-ray or else you can do is select uh, select the light source and the compass and right click on the object go to clone make a copy of it uh, you can make multiple copies on exactly what number of I mean how many suns do you want for your analysis I'm going with three and now what we have to do is uh, if we are making three copies then we have to divide the intensity of the Sun with that number alright so we're doing three copies that means it has to be somewhere around 0.33 and similarly do that for other suns as well so go to daylight 3.33 and then daylight 1 .33. all right so now all these sun has been uh, cloned or copied it at the same place so now to do multi sun analysis what you have to do is select the sun go to modifiers then click on setup and now it will show you the control parameters of the date and uh, month and time zone uh, of your sun 
simply change the sun to exactly what time you want and similarly select the other sun change its time to, to whatever you want for your analysis it's currently not showing anything on the screen because in the viewport it's set to standards click on it go to high quality view you'll see your shadow results and yeah and if you want to render this view just click on render setup select your rendering uh, engine to vray gpu and click on render all right so that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it thank you very much